Hey guys, what's up? It's me, the Dominus Cygnus, and I'm playing a brand new game from Valve. It's Aperture Desk Job. Man. Now, Valve is well known for their amazing games Welcome for the PC, to the but this has been specially designed for their employees. Steam Deck. I'm not I'm playing it on Steam Deck because you can just play it on your PC. You With a controller, you need a controller. No, don't be bashful. It's true. No false modesty. Let's get started. And here we go. Look at all those tubes stretching off in the distance. You know, Every one of them's taking it's interesting to see all these little games based on these the like properties. Forever. You know, you saw like Half Life Alex was to like take it. advantage of the VR system. How you you see this game from the Paul franchise to you? take advantage of like Steam History Deck. Will remember what it does you make do you wonder today. if they're ever going to release another, another large title, all of us, all of you know, continuation to any yeah. of these series. So congratulations. You are about to take part in the greatest science adventure at the greatest applied sciences company on Earth. This is important work, and you are just the genius to do it. Okay. I gave you these gifts. I'm giving you the opportunity to use them. It's running really well, well I gotta say. I don't mind telling you, we're excited up here. Moon landing excited. Newton, Einstein. Oh, wait a minute. That's, you. that's not right. I think I put the wrong tape in. Hold on. Oh, here Good we luck. go. I knew World's it. Best science. Okay, here we go. You, in the overalls, get to work or you're fired. I knew it. I don't give out overalls anymore. Anyway, my name's Grady. You can call me that. I mean, let's do introductions later. You should really sure. be. <sighs> Honestly, I'm surprised you're not fired already. Anyway, I, I just got uh, here. Calm down. A, uh, ba -ba -ba, product inspector. Oh, that great. That is your inspection desk there in front of you. You will be inspecting, uh, okay, uh, doesn't say. Anyway, something is going to come down the conveyor belt, uh -huh. whatever it is. Make sure it works. Once you've done that, keep doing that. That's the whole job. Anyway. This sounds like a tech demo. The thing is to have fun on your own time before you come in. Otherwise, it's just, I don't know, it's, it's real bad here. <laughs> It's well, at least he's honest. You'll probably be fine. Good luck. Right. And it sounds like a tech demo type of thing, but hey, I'm going to have fun. Right. Okay. Alright. I see. Wait, I don't have L5, L4 buttons. What? Okay, I'm guessing that was a joke, perhaps. Alright. Yeah, everything's looking good so far. Alright. Nice. I see no problems with this toilet. Yeah, toilet works perfectly. Once I press the button that line. Dang it. Can't believe it. Alright, so I'm guessing now we're gonna see a toilet that fails, right? Can't just be another toilet that does amazingly. Oh my god. This is uh, the most... Ex uh, it's all gonna go amazingly, guys. It's just another 9 to 5, you know, you just watch the toilets and, like, they're all gonna work. You know, because nothing exciting is gonna happen in this video. I don't even know why you're watching, honestly. This is just a perfectly mundane... Damn it. I knew it. I, I left the volume down. Hold yeah, on. Zip, zap, zap. That is how you inspect a toilet. I hope you were paying attention because I'm not saying any of that twice. Look, it's not rocket science. It's not even toilet science. Here's everything you need to know. See that light on the wall? Uh -huh. If that light goes on, you're fired. <sighs> okay, good. You heard the important part. Wait, sure. Wait. Hold on. Have they all been smoking? No. You know what? It's not our job to test if the toilet's on fire, right? Just do your regular thing like normal. Move it down the line, and then it's somebody else's problem. Sure. I mean, the water they'll put it out, I'm sure. You think your job's bad? I mean, do you hear that? Hold on, I'll, let me take a look. Yeah, oh. keep testing it. I, oh. <laughs> Can you get me out of here, please? Thank you. Uh. Nope, I'm just wet now. <laughs> no, no. It's working. Keep doing that. Oh my god. Oh, there's bullets in it now, isn't there? Yep, yeah, there we go. I think, uh... Just test it. Get it out of here. Oh god. Oh god. 
Jesus. So, first off, I I think we're in a lot of trouble here. That's now, fine. I also think just another day in aperture rich, science. Because I think he just admitted something. Okay. A gun Here's toilet. What we are going to do? Well, pitch I'm it. Go work on this in secret. Just you go back and pretend to go back to work, right? Like it's gotta look good. I mean, just pretend the most you've ever. How are you, you going to pitch this? To Have your enemies to take their yeah, shit, and it'll be the final. Be <laughs> and they'll be in the shit once they get shot up the asshole. Ridiculous. Oh, hold on. My job's been interrupted. How can I investigate toilets now? Oh, those are some very smart praying mantises. Have I just been investigating toilets for six months? What a job. How much do I get paid? Hey, Wait, what I'm do you back. mean I don't get paid? Yeah, I'm back. Uh, first off, you did awesome pretending to calibrate all those toilets. The best. All right. I mean, I actually was. This? Presenting. Oh no. Uh. Press. You gotta press the button. Presenting. Press the. Yep. Presenting. Oh. The aperture science turret. Go on. Take it for a spin. I. The controls are ready. Yeah. And I haven't what? shown you the best part. Here's the best part. I'm gonna have it shoot me. Shooting. You know what though. I mean, you're definitely going to kill yourself with it pointing at you like that. So let me just turn it around. Aww. They knew what I was going to do. Right, shoot again. Don't worry. It's safe. I mean, this time. This time it's safe. Last time it wasn't. You almost died. Wow. Oh, Holy God. moly, man. That is great. Yeah. Oh, my my man, work is broken. Bro. Now how am I going to investigate one, toilets? But don't even worry about it, because here's what I've actually been working on. Wait, you're just what? Ta-da! Introducing it's actually the Mark worse. Two. This is what I spent most of the six months on. It's it actually one month worse. For the first turret, and then like five for this bad boy. Oh man, you gotta take my picture with this. Uh, the desk should have a camera built into it. Oh. There you go. Okay, good. Moment recorded. For all the history books. I thought they said the keyboard wasn't part, part of this on the you Steam page. Are gonna take it for a spin? Here, let me turn it around. Yeah, I I would take turn it. Around. Okay, normally I'd walk you through everything, but I think you get it. Let's just open everything I... at once and see what happens. What the fuck? Okay, go crazy. All the wow, right? Ah, uh, this is great. This thing shoots so good. Okay, a bar fell off. Keep going. All right, something else fell off. You can still shoot everything else. Don't even worry about it. Um, I'm fairly okay, certain this thing is... Quite a bit's falling off. Okay, go crazy. I'll keep shooting. You're not doing this. This is a structural engineering problem. It's on me. You're doing great. I bet it's the glue. I'm 99% convinced of that. It even looked cheap when I bought it. I remember looking at it like, ah extra dollar and yep here we are yeah i don't know what else to do oh it's all broken now oh god can i go back to investigating toilets now oh oh dear oh 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 dear that's not great uh am i going to clean that up Wow. All right. That, so some of the stuff I put on there just didn't work. Most of it, like 90%, uh, or even higher maybe. But yeah. some of it worked great. So all we you have sure to do is that? keep the great stuff, and then we, then we can... So, okay. That's the police. Yeah. So one of us needs to streamline this turret, right? And right. one of us needs to take the fall for shooting up the warehouse. Because oh. they're, this is a lot of damage, and they're going to look into this. Which job, which job do you want? How about I fix a turret, and then you take... Uh, yeah, I'll do I'm, that. I mean, I'm not much of an Remember, engineer, so I guess asks, that's fine. You don't know me, okay? Don't say anything. I forgot who you are anyway.
I wonder if they'll drop the charges. Oh, no they didn't. Oh, that was a rat. Hey, well I mean, wow. You are the best. Thanks for keeping your mouth shut and doing your time. Sure. I mean, it was way more time than either of us were expecting. I don't know what was in those boxes we blew up, but they were, wow, were they mad. Uh, I promise you I'd be mad even if there wasn't this. anything in the boxes. Get you out of here. Given that the offender has faithfully observed oh. the rules of the institution, offender has been granted supervised early release. Oh. Please sign for your possessions. Inmates' possessions are as follows. Desk. One. Inmate must state their name, print their name, then sign their name. After the tone, state your name into the desk. Ah! Oh, ah! Oh my god, that's actually recording. Inmate's name is now preserved for the permanent record as... Ah! Oh, ah! That actually recorded it. Oh my god. Moving on. Now, type your name. The Dominus Ignis. Oh God! I'll do what I'll do. I'm gonna do be distinguished. I'm gonna do a doctor's Sign signature. There you go. As a condition of supervised early release, parolee and desk agree to report within 15 days. Hey, don't listen to her. You don't need to worry about reporting to your parole officer. Guess who spent the last 18 months getting his probation agent license through the mail? Yep. Through the mail? That's right. I'm your parole officer. Oh, God. I mean, not just you. I'm managing like seven guys on parole right now, but they're basically reintegrated back into society. Well, not Tony. He's struggling a little, but anyway, that's all I was doing. Just kind of I mucking around figuring out the controls here. It is never too late to met. You are both free to go. How do I get the oh, desk out? Uh, bring your desk. Uh, I might need a little help here. I want to know how to do those plus and minus buttons. I'm not sure how to do that because it just pauses the game if I press my okay. start I and select buttons. The turret while you were gone, oh no! The Mark Three. Look, I just went to jail. So I got rid of all the parts that fell off and just kept the stuff that worked. I mean, it was totally over engineered, so it just does one thing now. It shoots. It didn't need a satellite dish. That was just dumb. Here, try it on these appliances I found. They were just lying around in the house oh, no. apartment in, in a locked room. It's just like the Mark I. That trigger. I like that tattoo on your neck. Did you do it yourself? It's like a. Is it a no. Holding a knife? It's nice. No, I didn't have any choice the more in the I'm matter. Tattoo, the more I'm thinking we should both have, because then we'd be tattoo bros. Anybody would gonna look at us and know we are friends. Look at this. This is definitely a tech demo. I I'd, like they're just kind of uh, mucking around. Like, like this is mucking around with different mechanics. I'm sure this has to be leading into like something down the line. We won't know it now, I'm sure, but it would seem silly for them to work on all this and not flesh it out for something another time. Speaking of being cool, I've got something even better to show you. Gyroscopic controls. Wait, it's what? Real easy. Just pick up the desk, tilt it around to aim, and keep that thumb on the right thumbstick. I don't and think you shoot with the right trigger like normal. Go I don't on, think my controller it. connect. I don't think my controller works with gyro. It's real easy. Just pick up the desk, tilt it around to aim, and keep that thumb on the right thumbstick. How much did the tattoo hurt? I told you that it had nothing to do with me. Oh, oh you missed that one. Try another. Oh, oh, you missed that one. Try another. Another tattoo idea I just had instead of a robot hand coming out holding a wrench. What if it was like a skeleton? Can you 
you know, so you're looking at it like, what's he trying to say? Is he human on the inside, or does he have like a skeleton trap in him? You know what? You've got terrible ideas for tattoos. I decided. That's the one I want. So when we get a free minute, I'll find a pen and we can eat up that light. Jesus. Right. Everything checks out. This thing is perfect. I think we're good to go here. So, I was okay. saving the best for last. Oh no. While you were in jail, I got us a meeting to show our turret to Cave Johnson. No. That's right, the owner of the company. I don't want... No pressure, but if he likes this, he's going to make us rich forever. What are you, you going to do with money? Plus, wait a minute, hang on. Actually, never mind, I haven't been paid this entire time. I'll take any money. I don't care what you do with the money, as long as I get some. What the fuck? Those praying mantises are so cool. It cave. Uh. Okay, the fire is not the, the toilet. That, that makes a nice change. What are you gonna do with your share of the money? I know what I'm gonna do is pay off the money I borrowed to make this turret. Good. Like immediately pay it off. Or I'll, I mean, phew, I'll be in some real trouble. Yeah. Plus the VIG, I'll have to pay that too. <sighs> Does it make sense to you that the VIG is more than what I borrowed in the first place? It doesn't seem like it's oh. weird. Somebody overrode the controls. Hold on. Huh. Don't worry, I'm sure it's nothing. Hmm. Ooh. It's a washing machine. Huh. That's one of the appliances I stole from housewares. Oh! Oh, jeez, it's got a gun! It's an ambush! Man, he got that no, turret good, huh? my toilet. Good thing I brought a couple spares. Oh. There we go. It's fine. They stole our idea, and now they're gonna kill us with it. Housewares, man. That's uh, it's. They're it's, never gonna stop them pushing it. I mean, it's okay. Really I can't really coming. go to look that uh, far down. I think they're gonna stop coming though. We need to think of something else. Mike, I mean, if you keep thinking, I'll just do this in the meantime. I really think they're gonna keep coming for like basically forever. I mean surely we'll reach the top floor eventually. Let me get you a new turret. I didn't bring a ton of those though. That might be my last one, maybe two more. There we go. Is there? There we go. Oh, look at that. Oh, I guess we don't have to worry anymore. Yeah, I got a few bullet wounds. I got the elevator working again. But we have another 80 floors before we get to cave. We're not going to survive 80 ambushes in a row. I don't think I'm surviving the ones right now. I'm kind of bleeding out right. Those fire the rockets that got built into the desk. They put those on their standard now for safety reasons. So, if you hit automatic death noise detector engaged, Ooh. here we go. We are going to launch in 10, 9, uh, 8. Is this going to help with me bleeding out? Modesty panel set to flight configuration. 3, 2, 1. Oh, God. We well, time to rip all the. Oh dear. Okay, really nice work. Good shooting. I think we're good from here. They probably gave up. I have given up by now. I think I've got a major head okay. injury. I just Let's went through the roof. 
Also, you might have to do the talking for me. I didn't actually get an appointment with Cave Johnson. I lied about that. But it turns out, Great. I didn't know this, it turns out nobody's seen him in years. I did know it when I lied to you about our appointment, but it was still pretty new information. Anyway, I'm not gonna lie to you anymore. <sighs> I think he might be a millionaire recluse now. So, uh -huh. be ready for that. Well, I mean, he's got lavish doors. Hello? I could probably rip off some of that fabric to cover up my wounds. Is that a Moai head? No, it's a giant Cave Johnson head. Let's just go in. He's a giant! I can't believe it! Science really is a miracle. Mr. Johnson, are you here? Hey there. Who? It's me, Cave Johnson. It is a giant no, head. No, not behind the giant head. I am the giant head. I'm gonna level with you. Huh. A few years back, I got real sick. Body riddled with disease. I was a goner. Threw every dollar I had at it. Told those eggheads, hey, eggheads, make me live forever. Now, I know what you're thinking. You gave the smartest engineers on... Hey, hey, hey! I can't talk over the sound of you shooting me. You want me to tell you why I'm a giant head or not? Right. Where was I? Giant head, riddled with disease, uh -huh. eggheads. Ah, now I remember. Now, I know what you're thinking. You gave the smartest engineers so. on Earth a blank check to make you immortal, and this is what they came up with? A giant head? Yeah. <laughs> Off by a mile. No. They figured out how to put my consciousness in a computer. That's what's in the giant head. Oh. Their first plan was to put me in a regular brain-sized computer. Then they'd put that in a robot body, and hey, presto. Well, turns out you can't fit an entire human mind in a computer that small. All I huh. could do was tell time and know what my name was. So they kept making it bigger. Big enough to cram every last bit of me into this thing. What happened to my robot body? So he's alive. Still under the head somewhere, all crushed up. Couldn't support the weight. So the lab boys put me in the big head, switched me on, and uh, I don't know, I panicked. Killed a few of them. Said I'd kill more if they ever came back. Honestly, I, I regret that now. Anyway, hmm. that was four years ago. Been trying to get somebody's attention ever since. Well, I hope you have good luck with that. And my suffering. Now, don't worry about me. It's been a full life. But we're done here. I'm itching for the next step. Heck, I'm excited about it. Uh huh. Don't even think of it as killing me. You're breaking me out of prison. Am I going to be five for this? Data now. I need you to crack this big clay head open so I can spill out into the universe. Fine, fine, fine. I'm trapped in a head. I'm sad. You're fired. The end. If you're not going to help, get out of my office. Wait. It's something the two of us invented, sir. We came up here to show you. I think it might be the answer to your problem. Huh. Fine. Yeah. You're provisionally unfired. Let's see it. Hey. Show him, partner. Okay. Well, waiting. I thought you were two lunatics who dragged the toilet up here, but you are geniuses. Sure. You called us geniuses. I, I guess. I mean, it's his. This it's, it's, it's his to idea. Find his weak spot. But this thing's made of clay. It's all weak spot. Oh, it is brave thing actually. Huh. Am I gonna get a promotion for this? Oh. oh no! What? You are made of metal, sir. So shoot the metal. Is it working? In the head, I can't see. I think it is. Looking great, sir. It doesn't feel. Oh. Oh no. Do you have a replacement toilet? Hey, you see that? Oh. I think that's his power source. Look at that. Okay. We oh, do it. Here we go. Ooh. Powering down. Nice. We did it. Right beyond. Time for my promotion. Boy, I'll, I'll give you two credit. That is one hell of an invention. You did it. You figured out how to end my suffering. Well, they just got to plug you back in. All right. Suffering ended in three, two. Ah. Uh. Huh. 
There was a lot. Backup power activated. Oh god damn it. Uh, you're both fired. Wait. I need your key cards. Just lay them down in front of the head. Not too close to the chin, or I won't be able to see them. We could just turn off the backup uh -oh. power. Oh, so wait, how are you getting back? How are you getting more power if you're unplugged? Strange. Oh, he's gone. Ooh. You okay, Mr. Johnson? Mr. Johnson? You know what? It just occurred to me. I think he might be in worse pain than I am. Who knows Cave Johnson asked us to kill him is now dead. Yeah. Do you know what the punishment for murder is? They told us in parole officer school, you're not going to like this. Uh, it's life. Your whole life in prison. And give me time to work off we these should... bullet wounds. Yeah, we, we, we should leave. Don't touch anything. And bring the desk. Oh no! That's the worst tragedy of the whole game. Morning, Charlie. It's me, Gary. Gary, your boss. I'm not Charlie. Keep inspecting Who are you, toilets. Gary? Good work, good stuff. Good. Hey, it's just me, Grady. Yeah, just like yesterday. Oh, man. You lied to this me. This witness protection program is great. I don't know why we didn't turn state's evidence against those loan sharks in the first place. We don't have to pay any of the money back. We got cool new names. I like yours. Oh, a you lot, got the tattoo. The you know, come to think of it, you think they'd move us to another state or give us new jobs or something. Feels like everything fine. is exactly the same, except our first names. Listen, it's fine. You know I I they love investigating toilets. Anyway, see you tomorrow, Charlie. I love investigating toilets. Anyway, that one's good. Oh god, there there he is. Uh Oh god. S what? Is this is this how the turret started singing or something? That's horrifying. There's nothing I can add to this. I can't continue the bit on this. This is just ominous. Huh, look at that toilet turret mark two is good for something. I can sing. Well, there we go. That was a short one. Yeah, this is definitely more of a tech demo type thing. It does make me wonder, though, like, if they've got more planned. Like, they've made a Half-Life game, they've made a Portal game. Like, well, technically, you know, game set in Aperture. Maybe there is more planned in the future, but this is just them testing the waters with new ideas. I'd like that if possible. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please remember to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys!